The Langley Rivermen are in town this weekend, closing out the BCHL regular season against the Spruce Kings. They played the first game of a weekend doubleheader last night in front of a packed house at the Coliseum. Spruce Kings versus Langley, the hometown team is looking to finish strong against their divisional rival, Rivermen. Early on, Jacob Reichert fans on the shot but beats Jesse Jenks on his second try. Then, moments later, Reichert feeds Matt Ustaski for the two-on-one. He beats Jenks to the glove side and the Rivermen lead by two. The Kings answer in the second. Affiliated player Austin Gray finds a loose puck in the crease for his first BCHL goal in his first BCHL game. That's a special moment for the Prince George minor hockey product. Then on the power play, Ludke finds Staley with the pretty pass. Staley makes no mistake and the game is tied. But before the second ends, the Rivermen retake the lead. Local boy Tyson Watala tips one past Jenks and Langley is up by one after 40. Early in the third period, Braden Nett takes a nice feed from Jake LeBrun and goes bar down to even the score at three. Then Mitch Eden finds Matt Payne showed in front, but he's denied by Crossweight. Minutes later, Robinson can't convert the wraparound, but Mitch McLean finds the loose biscuit. He buries it for the GWG. Spruce Kings fall 5-3 to the Rivermen. Catch the rematch tomorrow at the Coliseum at 7. You know, we worked hard. You know, it came down to mental mistakes. For the most part, we played hard, and they're a good team. you got to take your hats off to them. I think it's a chance to look at video, look at those four goals that they scored, and then they had the empty netter as well, but the four goals they scored even up, uh, we get a look at those and maybe tighten things, some things up and, you know, uh, look at some offensive plays we can maybe draw up and, you know, it should be a better game tomorrow for us. It was pretty special. I wasn't expecting to score it all tonight, but, I mean, it's always a bonus to get one of those. It was pretty special. The puck just ended up in the crease and I saw it was free and just kind of poked at the puck blindly and it ended up going in the net. So.